all hell a bit, it's your boy Big Bid B and we back for another edition of Big Bid Business. Today we are back with yet another fragrance unboxing. Look man, I've been doing some strange things to these boxes, okay? I've been getting them in and I've been crushing them. So listen man, um, I got an email in from the good people over at English Laundry. Listen man, I'm speaking the Queen's English. So listen, a lot of you guys have been hitting me a Big Bid B. Listen man, we need an English Laundry review. You talked about arrogant, you talked about Wednesday, you talked about all these different fragrances, but now, I have one. So shout out to the people over at English Laundry. I gave them a list of about four or five fragrances and said, hook your boy up. So let's see what they sent. Look, I appreciate that they sent these. Some people send popcorn peanuts. I'm like, what is wrong with you? Like, why would you ever send me popcorn peanuts? Those things are so messy. All right, so we got London here. I guess this was number one on the list because that's what they said. They said, we sent you the number one piece. Good day, mate. All right, so here's your presentation for English Laundry London. It's, uh, looks pretty cool, looks pretty regal. Did it just fight me back? There right, we go, man. Um, London, gold top, black bottle, blue writing, and gold writing. London on the back, so it's pretty same. Let's see how you guys did here. Three. All right, so four for a, oh, that's nice. Does this kind of smell like a Ventus? All right, this one smells a little bit like a Ventus. I get that apple, I get pineapple in here as well. Now, this doesn't smell like exactly like a Ventus, but put yourself in the mind of like Club Den Wheat Alone by Armoth and um, I'll hear my Laventure, right? So that's kind of what this one smells like. It's a good fragrance off the back. I really like it, but also I like Aventus, so it makes it really easy for me to like this one. So for the price point on this one, I don't think this one is bad. I think this retails for 85 bucks. When I go to Dillard's, I see like a whole collection of English laundry. Like they, they kind of own that whole spot <laughs> over at Dillard's, man. They got their own section. Um, but this one is nice. I tried to dive into some of the other ones for you guys just to, you know, make this easy, see which one's gonna be the best one for you to pick up, but this one, off the break is solid. I'll actually have to do an official review, do some true wearings and testings, let you guys know about the performance, the longevity, projection, all that good stuff, but first impressions, smells nice. I think this one would be a good pickup if you wanted like an Aventus vibe, but you wanted something that was more played down, more subtle, and also one that you did not have to order. A lot of these other ones, when we talk about Aventus clones, you actually have to order them, versus you have to go into a store, or you can go into a store and pick this one up. So obviously it becomes a little bit more expensive when you do that, but you can get your nose on on it determine if you like it immediately versus like ordering it not liking it and having to keep it so just something to think about i'll link everything for this one below as always i'm your boy big bear b don't forget to like comment subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend now we are back once again and hit the goddamn bell was that that was weird that wasn't even english at all that wasn't even english at all hit the goddamn bell